Hi guys, and welcome to Season 3 of Simulator Saturdays. If you haven't seen this series before, the reason behind it is I'm building a truck rig for American Truck Simulator, and I started with a simple shelf, and I am evolving it into a fully functional truck simulator. So if you'd like to see how that was all done, feel free to go back and watch the other seasons. Watch this episode first. I've got a few really big upgrades I'd like to show you guys, so without further ado, let's go. Welcome to Simulator Saturdays. Okay, to start things off, here's a short video showing the liquid cooling that I put on the video card. So hopefully now that it's liquid cooled, it'll help American Truck Simulator play a lot better. Right, as we can see from the pictures, I've got a big hole in the dash. And there's a nice little instrument cluster sitting in there. And here it is all lined up where I want it to be. So I opened it up. Attach these metal parts to the back so that it tilts forward a little bit like a real car. Here's what the back of it looks like. And this is the LED indicator rev limiter that came with it. It can be configured to do whatever, but right now I'm just using it as a rev limiter. Okay, here's the hole all fixed up the back piece mounted with these three screws cluster gauges are in place and I've got the gauges all back together now and here's a quick video of them working So then after all that I found this piece of metal out in the living room mod uh, it belonged to my roommate and I asked him if I could use it and he said okay. And as you can see here I was able to form it over top of the instrument cluster and make like a dash thing. Now remember, from these pictures all of this is eventually going to be wrapped in leather so you won't see any of this stuff at the end. And here it is with the wheel. So I went ahead on the other side of the dash and did the FU mother effort license plate uh, holder and I'm going to turn it into my glove box. So, here's the setup at that moment, how it looks. Here's another picture of uh, my friends sitting around playing on it. As you can see, I've moved the window switches down and I now have a, a four switch plate, which does the power and the cabin lights and a few other features I will show you at a later time. I've also installed these switches, so now there's almost enough switches for everything I need for a full functional truck simulator. Uh, as you can see, there's two pieces of wood coming out the bottom, and this is why. I am building a center console. Here it is from the top, and here it is from the side. Alright guys, that concludes another episode of Simulator Saturdays. Thank you for watching as always and uh, feel free to comment down below if you'd like to see anything or anything described. And as always, if you enjoyed that video and you'd like to see more great content from my channel, feel free to watch this video right here. And don't forget to subscribe. Catch you on the next one.